setting your XTC for third trimester cows. Some third trimester cows are as easy as any to do, like we see here. And unfortunately, some of the uteruses are deep in the abdomen. The repro arm must be inserted all the way down. And we find that brighter settings make seeing third trimester pregnancies easier. So here we have some very bright cotyledons. We have a two centimeter grid, so we've got six to eight centimeter cotyledons in this third trimester pregnancy. Here's how to increase the brightness of the image to get an image similar to that. The, our image, image here is a bit too dark. We press the menu button. We're going to press the exam button. Scroll down to frequency. We're going to press the minus button until we change the frequency to two and a half megahertz. We'll now press the exam button again, scrolling down the menu. We're going to increase the depth of focus to 12. We could go to 16. In this case, we'll stop at 12. Our image behind us is getting brighter. We want to get it brighter yet. So we're going to press the freeze button to scroll back up. Now IP settings can change brightness considerably, but IP2 gives a better image, so we'll leave it there. We scroll back up. We're going to increase the far gain to 30. Again, our image is getting brighter behind us. We're going to scroll back up some more. And we're going to increase the overall gain from 110 in this situation up to 117. And still not completely happy with this image. So let's scroll down to dynamic and lower the dynamic range right down. You'll see here we're going to go right down to 30. Now note how bright that image is getting behind us. And this is the image that we started with initially. The cotyledons are very distinct. We press the menu button twice. We're back out into active scanning mode. And in this situation, we have a two centimeter grid. We can see those cotyledons quite clearly. We see the calf's head, some membranes, a very useful image on pregnancies. Some opens might be more difficult to see. Let's recap what we did. We increased the overall gain. We decreased the dynamic, in this case, to 30. We increased the far gain to 30. We lowered the frequency to 2.5 megahertz. We left the IP alone, but don't be afraid to lower that to 1. And we increased the depth of focus to 12. Remember to save an image that you find useful. If you need any assistance with this, please contact us. You can give us a call at 877-890-2411. Thank you.